Well, good morning, friends. I hope you are well. Uh, we're here in Auckland and we're in the middle of alert level three lockdown. And we'll be hearing later on this morning or this afternoon about what will be happening for us. Here as a church, we need to make plans for Sunday. And so we're recording our service today and we're really looking forward to meeting you on YouTube or Facebook live premiered at 10 o'clock on Sunday. It's going to be really, really great. We'll be splicing some things together and I'll be looking in our series on encountering the spirit on the character of Samuel to see what we can learn about what the spirit wants to release in our lives today. Can I just encourage you again, please do connect with one another. Our life group leaders are here to support you as a support structure for the church. So please do link in with them or link in with our staff as well. We'd love to know that you are feeling connected with us as a community, as the body of Christ. I'll be sending a little e-newsletter out today. Look forward to writing that and I really hope you will be looking forward to reading it as well. Just in conclusion, I just had this little in our prayer meeting yesterday, we, had, we were looking at Psalm 91, and I just wanted to finish with these verses, which I thought would be, were brilliant for us. It's Psalm 91, uh, verses one to four. He who dwells in the shelter of the Most High will rest in the shadow of the Almighty. I will say of the Lord, he is my refuge and my fortress, my God in whom I trust. Surely he will save you from the foulest snare and from the deadly pestilence, rather appropriate. He will cover you with his feathers and under his wings, you will find refuge. His faithfulness will be your shield and your rampart. God is our fortress, friends. Let's remain encouraged in him. And I'll see you on Sunday. God bless you. Bye.